All right, guys, I'm going to just continue this, but I did want to separate it. Uh, but I am going to call it, I think, episode three and episode four. But this one is like a special. Uh, you know, this person probably watched the episode before. This one's like, what? You know what I mean? He's like probably raging that he didn't get any questions. <laughs> but uh, there's about, let's see, one, two, three. Four. There's about four other questions from other people, but... About eight of these questions come from the same guy. Um, and, you know, if people ask, if pe people can comment as many times as they want, if they, you know, ask good questions, I'm going to answer them. And uh, that's just how it's, that's just how it works. So, you know, feel free to do that. Uh, and all these, pretty much all these come from X Fruity Smoothie 1, who I talked about in another video. I was like, vanilla milkshake. <laughs> I do remember that. So, and I'll say the other questions when they come and who they're asked by. So all, until I say that, all these questions are from X Fruity Smoothie One, and it's uh, I, iPhone or Android. Uh, currently, I have a just an Android 1.0, your basic Android. But uh, I actually ordered the iPhone, the new iPhone, uh, like a week ago. So that's being shipped to me, you know, as I talk. So I don't know. I'll I'll, I'll roll with the iPhone for a year, and I'll be able to answer that question. But uh, all of these smartphones are, you know, pretty awesome with what you can do with them. Uh, well, what kind of car do you drive? I won't make fun of you. <laughs> no, that's, I mean, I, I drive a 98 Volvo. If you just type in 1998 Volvo, you'll probably see a picture of it. It's navy. It's a, it's a pretty good car. I'm happy with it. And uh, that was given to me by my parents after they got a new car. Uh, do you live, do you live by yourself? I do live by myself. I consider Rolo. Rolo is my dog, and she lives with me. And uh, Caitlin, Caitlin is over here probably three or four nights a week. So I do live by myself. I have the dog, and Caitlin's over here a lot. So I'm not lonely per se. What type of girls do you like? Any advice? Uh, is I don't know. I mean, if it, if it's just like a a, pers a personality thing what I look for or if it's like a you know what attractiveness qualities do I look for in a girl so I personality you know they have to be f they have to be fun they have to be like they have to make me laugh I don't know that's a big thing like I have to laugh with them or it just won't work um, and they just gotta be open to you know our acceptance or accepting of you know what I like to do, uh, but in terms of a tr like an attractive girl, I would probably like look at. I like the hair. I like a dark. I like a dark hair. I like, uh, like you know, you're not really like a, a super tan, super tan skin, but um, kind of like a. I guess how. Um, a, like a Kim Kardashian look, not in terms of like the body, you know, like she's like obviously like uh, gorgeous, but just in terms of like her skin, her skin tone, her hair and everything like that. Um, and the, the rest doesn't help or the rest helps too. <laughs> but, uh, you know, that's not to say that's the only girls I look, I, you know, I look for cause Caitlin is pretty much the opposite of that. <laughs> and that's okay too. What computer do you use? I'm running a Dell Studio XPS 14 right now. Maybe it's a 15. I have no idea. Uh, what's your What was your favorite subject in school? Always, always uh, like a U.S. history. Um, always my favorite teachers were history teachers. And that's what I was going to school for, to be a history teacher. But I changed to PE halfway through. But uh, I'm not in school anymore. If I go back, I'll finish it in PE. Fruity, or, you know, same thing. <laughs> are you religious? And what race are you? Um, I'm white. If that surprises people. Uh, I don't... <laughs> that would be a shock to me. Uh, and are you religious? I talked about this in another video. I'll probably... I don't... Maybe I'll just do like a kind of like a TDM special. I could probably talk about religion and my beliefs on religion for about like, you know, 15 minutes or so. Not like 40 minutes like I could in high school and that. But I'll do that in a another video. Uh, but 
I do believe in God. And I, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't go to church though. So, I guess if that answers part of the question, that'll be there. What was your favorite childhood game? Uh, I thought about this when I when I was posting the questions. Board game. Uh, I don't know. I used to play like with my brother and one of his his friends, and you know, one of my buddies who like lived in the same neighborhood, pretty close. We used to play like Star Wars Monopoly a lot, and that was fun, but. I'll I'll step it up a little bit and you know outdoor game. I love playing like backyard football. Um, in the winter, you know, I we played this game. It was like sledding. We called it like sledding challenge or something like that. Where like you know we had like four. It was like four friends. So it was like two on two and um, you know you got like an hour to build like the biggest and tallest ramp or something and then you just like went down the hill and. I'm surprised like nobody like broke anything, but that was the kind of stuff I did as a kid. <laughs> and I mean, there was no point to the game; it's just to have fun, like you know, building the ramp and you know, making it huge, and you know, pretty much having a sore back for you know the next couple days. <laughs> um, and that was the last one by Fruity Smoothie. So this is I I Chems. Uh, what made you get into commentating? I don't know. I mean, I just. I had a lot of, you know, I had a lot of free time, and, you know, I liked Wings, and I like all the guys who do the commentaries on YouTube, and to be honest, I felt that I could, you know, I could bring my two cents, and, you know, it was all about, A, making myself a better player, because if I was always talking about, you know, my games, and seeing what I did wrong, and talking about what I did wrong, what I did right, that would make me a better player, and... You know, talking about, or just having the opportunity to make somebody else a better player. <clears throat> Excuse me. But uh, that was a big thing, is like, just trying to help out other people. With You know, you, can, you should always try and help people, you know, if it's making them a better player in video games, or if it's, you know, helping somebody carry groceries down the street or something. If, they, if the opportunity presents itself, I recommend it. And the same the same question by I I Chem's favorite or uh, favorite wrestler all time living or dead. Um, wait, I <laughs> excuse me. I I Chem's asked the childhood game, and I I Chem's asked the get into commentating. Sorry, my organization skills on this notepad. I'm gonna have to change this. Um, Smith comma Benjamin asked favorite rest, wrestler of all time living or dead. Um, I'll do living and dead, and I'll probably, I said The Rock and Kurt Angle in my past videos, but they're not in, like, WWE anymore, uh, so I'll just do WWE right now. And my favorite wrestler probably is The Miz right now, I think he's gonna be, um, I think, he he's obviously already the real deal, but he's just gonna get better, and I think Cody Rhodes is gonna be like that too, where he's just gonna explode here in a little bit. And Dead, I would probably say, or I'll answer both, but Dead, I would probably say Owen Hart. Um, that was, like, such a tragedy in wrestling, and he was, if you ever watch, like, some of his matches where he put him on, like, early in his career, mind you, um, the, he's an absolute, he was an absolute stud. I think he was better than Brett, um, or he would have been. And Jagjit5276 asked what football or soccer team do you support don't say Barcelona please uh, no I do not like Barcelona at all uh, I pretty much pay attention to EPL and you know not really in any of the Spanish league but uh, I would probably say uh, I have a lot of respect for Manchester United uh, but that's just an extremely popular team I like Fulham because they bring in a lot of American players, and I like Everton because they have they are the same way. So if I had if I if I can't say Manchester United because that's just you know the douchey answer, I would probably say Everton. Yeah, probably Everton. So um, that's the end of this question. It actually ran longer than what I thought. So about two ten minute Q and A's, and maybe I'll try and post two. Uh, two TDMs per video unless I have a bigger a bigger TDM file I can put up 
for one of these. So thanks guys. If you have questions, um, post them in this video or usually I save the you know the question gathering for Sunday nights and I'll post that video on Sundays where I you know in that comment box ask the questions. So if you guys like it, you know like it. Um, if I uh, if I can do anything better, you know. Let me know, or if you guys want to see anything else, let me know. I'll gladly get pretty much any material out there in terms of YouTube, uh, YouTube gaming, I guess. Uh, so thanks, guys, again, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.